Hi, I'm here with the Cowlitz County Prevention Squad to talk about their upcoming social norms campaign. Jasmine, can you tell me about your project and why it's so important? Yes, so we know from research that people will mimic behaviors of what they think everybody is doing based on their observations of what others are doing. Okay, so are you saying as a middle school student, I might feel it was okay to wear two different colored socks to school because that's what I saw a lot of other students doing? Exactly, it is the same for things that are bad for us, like underage smoking and drinking and misusing prescription drugs. A social norms campaign is the perfect way to change these that's very interesting. Taylor, tell us how this social norms campaign can help change perception on youth substance throughout our local community. Well, let me tell you about it. What we are going to do is work to emphasize on the students that do not use substances. We will be doing this by displaying virtual posters and positive social norms on our Youth and Family Link social media accounts. We will also be sharing survey results and providing awareness and education on positive community social norms. All marketing will be working on highlighting and underlining the great amount of youth in our community that choose to be drug free. Stay tuned on our Youth and Family Link Facebook page to follow our campaign.